Miss Rena, we must escape faster or we'll be in trouble. I'm sorry, but I left my relief behind. I need to get it back. Forget about me. Save yourself. We just barely escaped from a horde of vicious bandits. Like literally the lowest human shits imaginable. Who do the things to you to ravage you for the rest of your life? And now you want to go back for your loving stick. Get the hell on! Look sharp, maggots. Devil Mountain, dead ahead. Any tips, Jagan? It will be tricky, sire. We have only one means of entry, and our opponents will no doubt make use of the port. Perhaps if we sent one man ahead, we can lure them. Doga volunteers. Indeed. And if you can seize the checkpoint, our rage units could support him until the rest of us can move in. Haha. <laughs> oh man. Doga. We're meant to be together. There's no denying it anymore. Kiss me, you fool. Oh, and don't forget we are to assist this Arena person. I understand she's being held to the north. Right, right. Cain Abel will go and rescue the cleric lady. Will we now? Yes, you will. You have some very interesting ideas. Abel, do not backtalk me. Get up there. Cain? I thought he was Cain. I bet you did. Look. Both of you just... just go. So I said, look buddy, see the scar on my face? See it, punk? How do you think I got this? Embroidering? Hey, Martha Pan, after this battle... <laughs> and what happened? Well, she threw her drink at me, then she left. Not my best pickup line overall. I was thinking maybe we could... How did you get that scar anyway? I don't like to talk about it. I know you can hear me. Oh, Sita, didn't see you there. Uh, go and help Cain and Abel. Cain and Abel? With the rescue. Might need some extra support, I don't know. Um, I'd love to, but there's just no room for me in that narrow pass. Not with the two of them there. I'd only get in the way. Sita, you have a flying horse. No, I don't. Yes, you do. Where? What horse? What are you talking about? Oh no, she's covering its face with her hands. I guess that means I can't see it. Fine, I'm going. I mean, anything for you, dearest. Julian, over here! Someone's come to help us! I'm confused. I thought we were only saving one woman. Oh yeah, because I have pink hair. Haha, <laughs> up yours! Well, that's not very ladylike. I guess you don't need any help then. Toodles! Wait. If y'all only take one, take him. Leave me if you must. Isn't that cute? She thinks we're taking them. Lady, you're misunderstanding a few things via via this rescue. We're going to start kicking rear end in T minus five seconds. Four. You may be alive when we're done. Three. If you are, good for you. Two. If not. One. Boo fucking who. We ride! Navar, why is someone with your strength fighting with bandits? What? How do you know who I am? I know many things. Hmm. How do you know who I am? You're talking. Why are you talking? You should be throwing down. I came here to throw down. Let's go. Let's do this. Or are you having second thoughts? Hmm? Maybe your little head is saying, Wow, I sure hope I don't have to spend the rest of my life with these subhuman outlaw scums that would definitely be beneath me. Is it saying that? That's exactly what's going to happen unless you, say, have a sudden change of heart and switch sides. This is your chance. Blow it. I dare you. My sword won't harm a woman. Uh, bullshit. Excuse me? Bull. Poo poo. Poo poo from a bull. I'll not have my principles questioned by a thief. Okay, so when you were chasing after Rena with your sword out, what was that exactly? Hmm. I had no intention of hurting her. Was it a rousing game of sword tag? Can I be it? Ah, ah. No more arguing, children. We're all friends now, yes? Yeah, cool. Maybe later we can play Red Rover with Loveling Halbert. Rear end in the top hat. Ho ho, you're quite energetic. Since you came all the way here to get this axe as a gift. 
Techno villagers, this is how you do it. No small talk, no waiting to be asked. Just make with the offering right off the bat. A plus. But this will suck your blood and eat your flesh. Never use it. Uh, this... This isn't a good present. Oh ho ho! Jagan. Sorry? Torch. Father, may I have a moment? Father? Are you speaking to me? Yes, may I? I'm not your father. Oh, uh, forgive me. You are a man of God, or so I thought. I am not a priest, and there is no God. There is only blood. Blood and false hope. I don't suppose there's any chance of a confession, then? Perhaps in another life. Except there is no other life. So, no. Hey, Bart's come here. I, uh... Got you a new axe. Really? Oh, you're a star, sire. Thanks. That's the mark of a good commander, you know. Looking out for his... troops. Yep, that's me. Always keeping an eye out. Alright, Doga, you're up. Hook us some big ones. Bandits, step forth and face Doga. Be crushed beneath his iron boot. What's all the noise? Some armored brick running his mouth. Looks like one of the princes. Your fortress is a chicken coop. And you, the clucking occupants, come out and die like men. Let's get him. Are you daft? That's what he wants. Doga will take your wives while you lurk. Stick to the plan. If they have to squeeze through the cliffs, we'll have the advantage. Your bellies are yellowed. Your hair is out of style. Your nethers are inadequately sized. Psst, Doga. Try this. Fighters are underpowered. Oh. Gently caress that. Time to make sushi, people. Let's go. Doga, Gordon, and, uh, Bluehead Kid. Who are you? I... I'm Kashim, sir. Princess Sita recruited me. Fascinating. Go and put some arrows in the bad man. Please let me go home, sir. My mother's sick. She can't take care of herself, sir. I have to go home. Oh, bah. She'd be dead by the time you got back. If she's not dead already. Which she probably is. Hey, I bet you feel better if you shot someone. Doga has removed the stopper. You heard the man. Get in there. Here we go. Looks like we've been granted... Access! For gently caresses sake. You think you've won? You bastards! Uh, with... One, two, three, four, five... Eleven against one? Yeah, I'd say it's a fair assessment. Fool! You may have overcome the rabble, but you will never defeat the mighty Hyman! Your... Your name is... <laughs> so... Uh... I take it this is your first time? Of course not! Hundreds have come here and fallen by my hand! Wow, you are a tough one. We're gonna need some protection. So you can take all of us at once, huh? Pretty impressive. You sure you're ready for this? You can always say no. Oh god, stop, I can't breathe. <laughs> poo poo, he wasn't kidding. He is tough. Dread it! Ha! Weaklings, all of you! I'll cut you down one by one! Your numbers mean nothing! Your law means nothing! Here on Devil Mountain, I am king! And I decree that, that, uh, uh that, uh, uh. Sup. We got that thing you wanted. Prince Marth. That's me. My lord, I am Sister Rina. I understand that you sent your bold knights to rescue me from those bandits. And I insisted on thanking you personally. Yeah, thanks, bro. What that I could offer more than gratitude? I'm afraid most of my possessions were taken. That won't be necessary. Actually, I have something for you too. It rhymes with description, and it isn't a prescription. Er, uh, subscription? No. Saya, look at this. The bandits left 15,000 gold in the castle. Tomorrow we'll arrive in Orleans. Please get plenty of rest tonight. Who the hell are you? You look trouble, my child. Is there anything I might- I'm a terrible son! 
Oh god! How could I let this happen? Dear god! Seriously, who was that guy? Anyone?